Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video of Genshin Impacts. So, we, st we stayed here, and we have to leave the Yeltsin camp, which is this way. We can see the upside down city from here, too! Yeah. Wait, watch out! What is it? <gasps> oh, wow! What's going on? Is that light coming from the room in the center? It's too bright! What was that? The mutation is continuing. Has the abyss made its move already? Yes. Oh. I see your incessant meddling continues. They're back. And that you have once again joined forces with our highness's kin. Oh, well. Regrettably, I was not in time to control your exit from the network. And it sent you here of all places. <laughs> this was a catastrophic error. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I am surprised that you dare to face me. You ran like a coward last time. Because it's a coward. Our Highness's will must be done. Oh, yes. All interferences must be removed. Whatever the price to pay. This time, the curse that torments our people must be undone. Once and for all. You are the only ones who torment them. Mm. There is nothing else left of those hilly churls. Nothing besides the curse itself. Say what you wish. I am going nowhere, Dameslift. Time to fight then the arrows. Give your life just to delay the inevitable. How absurd. But since you wish to persist, then so be it. Let's go fight some heralds. You really think you can use that device Take to that. the pool to cleanse this curse? Look at all the damage I did. Do not underestimate the the and he's just level 40. So odd. This is great. Then I overestimated you. I want so much to go to Sunro. So that I can... Um, oh. We have this here? So that I can level how high I'm the board on the road. And he's going to be a beast. Terra Smash! Boba, get them! Don't blink! Hey! Nice. Careful now. Definitely got this. Here you are. Careful. Incoming. Oh, it's going to do that. Oh wow. Careful, Kachan. Oh, he's up. Okay. Uh, there's a lot of wounds. Oh god. Careful now. Careful. Now. Careful, please. Jeez, Louise. Yeah, dear. Just be still. There you go. Yeah, the world will fall, but it's with you. Oh, and you get to break those shields as well. Damn. I'm in love with all hate him. He's so useful. The damage he break that sh that shield of the arrow just like paper. I need him leveled up right now. I love that guy. There's it's no just time to celebrate. Great. The abyss order's device is activating, but there's still time to destroy it. All right. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, because this guy, I mean, is good. He's really good. Oh, and I changed this image because I reached level, max level with that thing we used to have light in, in down here. Uh, this there have been many poorly that written applications like lately. Set max level. I guess I'll just oh. have to reject them all. We have this in here. Okay. We have to go up there again, so teleport over here. 
And let's go. Oh, we have a portal now? What's this? Touch. I touch. Oh, we're back. Oh, that's a new one. That's a new abyss mapper. Look, the amplification device. That I never saw. They're in pain. And pain is it's in pain as well. They're in agony. This is no way for them to meet their end. Find a way to stop that thing. Let's go, Ether. Is that half done? Yeah, it's half done. I have to what? Uh, don't do it. Oh. Give his life. He's dead. He's dead. I thought he would have been turned to ashes in an instant. Halfdan's soul is extraordinarily resilient. Meddling fool! Abyss Lector. Encumber us no more. Bat Baptist of the Ruined Kingdom? Don't you have oh. a greater encumbrance to worry about? Come on. This is your grand opportunity to get rid of me. Oh, I'm going to Take fight him out that? And deactivate the device. Oh, great. We're going to fight a new one. Okay. No matter. Has come. I got my man. The process of elimination. Use this. Here you are. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. I'm so sorry, my man. I am really sorry. When you get more powerful, you'll be better. Oh, that. Catching here. And then this. Oh! Right. I feel. I feel. Touch him. I kill there. Okay. Let me just. Oh wow! I don't have a lot of food to heal. Let me heal you because you're better. Oh no! Stop. Take this. Never mind. Hell yeah! This is all hate for you. The abyss lecture's gone, but the device won't stop. And half Hmm. No. As long as the device is active, the cursed are rendered powerless. Only you can take on the abyss. Okay. If you value his sacrifice, then do not waste any more time here. See all these rays of light and portals. They must have installed several of these energy devices in various locations. Find them quickly. Okay. So careful, Bane. Go through these abyss portals. Uh, hey, fight for Paimon! Oh God! I love this guy. Wow. Okay, there's a portal in here. Let's. Oh, I just need to touch it. The same way it did come from. Oh no! It's these ones! Oh god. This is not good. 
This is not good. Terra Smash! It's just me here. Oh, my catching is down. Here you are. Better way to. Okay, let's be careful that I don't want all hate and die. Take that. Alright. Do this. Uh, yeah, this way. One. Do this. Okay, he's down. Right. Okay, he's down. That does. Okay, break this. Really, girls are really suffering. Okay, nice. Oh, wait, Dane, this okay, must be a miracle that. for you too. You have to eat. A little of this. So, kitchen girl, get some food on you, and the rest is going to you. Right? Never mind that. Okay. Half Dan and the others are in. Let's go back. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, who's next? Okay, the same ones. Terra smash! Speed of light! Hey! Yeah, yeah, whatever. You're going to be fine. So, be a deer. Be good at the mage and don't run for me. Here you are, okay? That was cool, really? Mm. As you can see, it's doing pretty fine. There we go. Let's break this thing. Okay. We have this one. More of his mages, maybe? Yeah. Alright. Ooh, who's the worst? I don't know. Let's go this one. Oh, careful now. Come on. Speed of light. Okay, nice. Okay. Can you die? Okay, good. Right. Just one more portal to go. Which is this one. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, no, you, oh come on. I Stop killing him. Miscalculated. How dare you? Everything was being fine. Okay. All right. Gone dark all around oh. now. Shall we head back to the room in the center? Or do I go back? I think from this pillar. Yeah. Let's go. Half done. You good? So, that's it, right? The device is fully shut down now? The burning sensation has indeed stopped. So, we managed to stop the Abyss Order's plan? Oh, he's dead. <sighs> Let me check. He's dead, isn't he? Dane must be really upset. Of all the ways to be reunited with one of his former comrades after so long. This is rough. <sighs> Let's go. Yeah, he's dead. Huh? Uh. Oh. Huh? Light. <gasps> oh, it's half done in human form. <clears throat> Apologies, Captain Dainsliff, Twilight Sword. Back then, I failed you and failed to protect our people. <laughs> no. For 500 years, you have faithfully done your duty. To this day, I am proud of you all. <sighs> Conria didn't fall, did it? Since you're still here. Correct. So, no need to revive the homeland. That was Haftian's soul! Yep. More than one kind of strange power exists here. Souls are no strange sight under the circumstances. Still, if you intend to venture deeper in and continue your investigation, you ought to be careful. <coughs> Hey, you good? You bet! We'll be super careful! Oh, but... Dang! Does this mean you're not coming with us? That device took a severe toll on me. It will take me some time to recover. Okay. I hope you're, you get well soon. Oh! Right. Well, actually, Baiman already knew that. You've clearly been pushing through the pain this whole time. You've earned a good rest, Dane. Oh, you should take a vacation! Vacation? <laughs> the very notion. This word has no business being in my vocabulary. <laughs> there are more important things that demand my attention. The Loom of Fate operation is still underway, and I suspect that these amplification devices are connected to that plan. Thank you for understanding. I only hope that next time we meet, you know whose side you're on. Sheesh! He sure knows how to hold a grudge. Saving that snide remark right until the end. Well, shame that we didn't get to see your sister again. But at least we learned some useful info, huh? That's true. As long as you keep pressing on with your journey, you guys will definitely meet again. And everything will be back to normal. Right? Hopefully. Oh, Paimon almost forgot. The real reason we came here was to investigate what was going on with the hill trills, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. We've probably seen enough to report back to the miner now. But... Uh, how are we going to explain it to him? This is all way too complicated for regular people to understand. Uh, eh, we'll figure it out. Just don't forget about the commission when we're done here. Okay, I guess we have to report back to the miner. But it's already done. Okay. Ooh, we can already go to Sumeru. Okay. But I have still some things to do. 
like... Yeah, this is to go to Sumeru. But there's still this thing that I need to do. That I have to complete some story quests. I have this story quest and this story quest. So I don't know where to begin. This is great. This is really great. So we have Mona. Story quest to do and the Raiden Shogun's one. Because to do this one, I have to complete the Raiden Shogun Imperatrix Ambrosa. And um, the Taurus Hero Candice, which is Arataki Ito's story quest. So, yeah. I really don't know where I should begin. Wait. There's a lot to do, so no. I have to decide which one. We can go to Sumeru and start getting how high them thingies level up or complete the story quests and then do these Archon quests. I really don't know what we should do first. I'm lost, but I'm probably going to do Mona's mm, whatever. story quests. Sumeru can wait, right? Yeah, it can wait. It's not like it's going away, so... And if I'm not mistaken, I can go to a friend's world and just farm the items I need to level up I'll hide them, so I guess it's not that big of a deal to go to Sumeru right now. So yeah, let me just heal our characters because they're in a bad state. Thank you. And we need to go over this way. All right. Let's just move. Oh, there she is. That's her, right? Finally. You know me? Mona? I almost fell asleep waiting. Oh. As usual, my predictions are correct. You, yes you, come with me. Huh? Are you some sort of door-to-door -door fortune teller? <laughs> Sorry, but we're not really interested. <sighs> You're not from this world, are you? <gasps> she knows? Hello? How do you know about that? Yeah. How? Because I'm a master of true astrology. Huh. If you've no other questions, let's be off. <sighs> Fine. I'll exercise a little patience and explain. I am Astrologist Mona Magistus, but considering that it is most rude to misremember names, I allow others to call me Mona. Okay. I am on a mission from my master to retrieve a certain box from Mondstadt. Hmm. It was part of an agreement she made with a friend 50 years ago, but she isn't as spry as she used to be, so now it's up to me. Okay. Not sure what getting some box back has to do with us. Why do you need us to come along? No idea. Well, that's because I would also like to take on the guardian of the box. My master and her friend contended in the mystic arts all their lives without a clear victor. If I triumph here, then I will show myself to be superior to my master. Ahem. <clears throat> well, I want to prove the power and status of astrology, to be precise. Right. Now, from my predictions, I know that my master's friend has left Mondstadt, leaving her successor as the current guardian of that box. Like me, that successor must also be one who has surpassed their teacher. I must not be careless, but I would prefer to assure my victory in this contest, and upon giving it some thought, you came to mind. The knowledge passed down to me from my master must be passed on in turn. 
If I were to bring my disciple to meet her, then the lead is already mine, no? And you are Mondstadt's great hero, my equal in status, so... Come on, you don't actually have to become my disciple. You just need to act the part. Okay. There's something in it for you as well, should you come with me to get that box. Now oh, then. Once I meet that successor and have a chance to exchange knowledge with them, I should be able to read your fate more accurately. Then I will have answers for you, even regarding such distant and foggy matters as gods and kin. Hmm. That does seem much faster than searching the land country by country. Right? <laughs> a wise decision. That said, I would like to pay a certain place a visit before we go. Okay. So, if we help her, we can get answers about the gods. There is a small inn near Mount from the Tienhung beginning. that never sees a lot of business, even though its food is always great value for the money. And about our sister. So... Let's just help her if we need all the information we the can. The owner has always been good to me, so I'd like to say a farewell before I set off. Oh, let's take those carrots. It's always needed. Okay. Oh, there's that over there. I can't believe that. Sometimes it gives me treasures. Let's just break all this. Yeah, there we go. Don't let any of it roll away now. There's supposed to be a silly somewhere because there's a um, thing for it to go in. And it's supposed to be that way. Hmm. I have no idea where it is, so. Okay, let's go. Let's take those sunsetches and talk to Mr. Zoo. Well? It's no wonder that an inn set up here has no business. Mona, oh, you've come at just Fucking the right time. Good. Did you see a jade ring while you made your way here? A jade ring? Can't say I have. Oh, that's not good. The ring was given to me by my mother, but while my back was turned, it was swallowed up by a slime. Hmm, that should be no trouble with Mona here. She's really good at astrology. Absolutely not. Astrology is meant to be used to gain insight into reality and observe destiny itself. It's certainly not for such mundane affairs. But didn't you say that the owner here has been good to you? Mm -hmm. This is a matter of pride and one state of mind. If an astrologist thinks that their arts can solve all problems, they will be forsaken by the starry ether. Their divinations will lose the power to guide, will not be able to pierce the fog of the unknown before them. Principles are principles. Such a powerful ability, and you don't use it to earn a living? What a shame. Uh, well, I was going to put up 20,000 mora as compensation, 20, if you were willing. Uh, 20,000? Oh, uh, it's nothing. I... I was just thinking that the person who finds that ring must be lucky indeed to be able to earn 20,000 mora just like that. <laughs> <clears throat> yes, of course. Still, the owner's business has had it pretty hard. It must be a truly extraordinary ring to be worth spending this much mora to find. It wouldn't be right for us to leave like this, so let's help to search for it. There may be other means we can employ besides astrology. Oh, Paimon knows where this is going. I know. I'll leave this one to you. This is the first mission I'm giving you as your master. Hmm. Since it was swallowed up by a slime, maybe we can use Elemental Bait to lure all the nearby slimes to us. Oh, that's you remember monster. the stuff we helped Master Diluc make? Yeah. And... <laughs> Paimon actually kept a small amount. Paimon's the very best partner, right? Seems like you already have a plan. Yep, we'll be back in a jiffy. Okay. Let's go find some slimes. The elemental bait's really strong. It will attract all the slimes in the area. Even if they're just slimes, they can be dangerous together, so we'd best prepare ourselves. Okay, there they are. 
Love him. There's more. Well now. Hey, hey, stop it. Come on. Okay, use this. Mr. Zhu. <laughs> hey, we got your ring. That's it. That's the one. Ah, I thought it was lost forever. You actually found it. Not bad. Mr. Zhu, you must take care of such precious things a bit better. You might not be so fortunate next time. You're absolutely right. How would I have faced my family if I had lost the 253rd ring my mother gave me? What? Oh, let me explain. My family owns three jade mines, oh. and in order to ensure that I would be able to find myself a good wife, my mother had many jade accessories made as heirlooms. Mm. I think there might be over 500 of them. Damn. Then why would you feel the need to set up an inn here? Well, inheriting the family business too early unavoidably made things boring. Thank you, all the same. Here's the Mora, as agreed. Please take it. Then? Then I'll take it, gladly. But we did all the work! A disciple should act like one. How can they steal their master's thunder? Exactly! Well, you need to start practicing now. If my rival is as smart as I think they are, they will figure you out in a heartbeat. And she's hungry. Uh, what was that rumbling sound? Oh, right. You mustn't have eaten in days. I'm very sorry. I forgot that you have no... Ah, uh, <laughs> That didn't happen. Forget it. <laughs> well, I suddenly feel that you have indeed contributed to our good fortune. I say we spend this money on treating you to a fine meal. If we travel north, we'll reach the Wangshu Inn. I hear the food there is really good, so let's go try it out. No need to thank me, I'm just doing as a good master should. Did she say she was treating us? Is Paimon hearing things? Let's go after her for good food! Of course Paimon wants to eat. This life isn't bad either. I so, guess I can keep living like this. The Wangshu Hen. And it's down there. See <laughs> <laughs> Since it's Mona's treat, we can order whatever we want, right? Of course. I am a most generous master, after all. But only if you can finish it all. Wasting food simply will not do. I agree. 
Excuse me, what would you like to order? Hmm. Could be this. This is a favorite among our regulars. Bamboo shoots, meat, and ham are cooked together, creating a richly flavored soup. Pour a few spoonfuls into each bowl of rice you eat. Mm, you'll never get enough of it. It's exactly what it says on the label. Abalone made from vegetarian ingredients. It's just as good as the real thing. Though tofu could not be a more ordinary ingredient, it and crab roe are truly a match made in heaven. It's one of our specialties. These are made using large succulent shrimp wrapped in crispy fried potatoes. They have an amazing texture. Uh, all, all of them? <laughs> we only have three. No, two and a half people? Isn't that too much food? That's not how you count it. Besides, Paimon hasn't even ordered yet. Ahem. <clears throat> Squirrelfish, Juyu chili chicken, and Joy soup, please. Sure. And is there anything else you'd like to order, ma'am? I... I'd just like to ask, how much do the current dishes cost in total? Um... Around 20,000 mora. Then... Uh, I'll... I'll just have some vegetarian noodles, please. All right. A bowl of vegetarian noodles, was it? Please wait a moment. We'll serve you shortly. Paimon's been thinking about something since we started eating. Is it? Because she actually doesn't have money? I heard that. I said I was treating. How could I be rattled by something as mundane as Mora? An astrologist's mind is set on studying the stars. Being so easily disturbed by such banal matters would hamper my judgment. Especially the act of overly gratifying oneself using Mora. It is both vulgar... ...and dangerous. <laughs> so, not eating the dishes we ordered is also part of an astrologist's pride? Yes. Pilot doesn't get it. But it feels kind of bad that only we got to feast. Oh, yes! We can do that! Just give us a minute! You don't use more to fulfill your desires, so it's fine as long as you're not buying anything, right? Let's go borrow the hey kitchen everyone. from the innkeeper! I'm going to end the episode here, so don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and activate the notification bell. And I'll see you all in the next video.